Yeah, we're going to start to see these pop-up showers moving through, and we're already tracking this on Storm Ranger. That's our mobile Doppler radar. This is going to be the perfect day to have the NBC Bay Area app because it tells you when rain is moving right where you are. So you need this on a day like today when one minute it's sunny and then a few minutes later it's raining. We're seeing that happening now in Marin County as well as parts of San Francisco. We're going to start to see more of this activity with some light morning showers and then the possibility of some some afternoon thunderstorms once we get that daytime heating and a little bit more energy in the atmosphere going along with this storm we could see some small hail some brief heavy downpours along with some gusty winds but then we start to see this kind of filling in a little bit more as we go into this evening with some more activity across the bay area notice all the different colors there where you see the blues and the pink that shows a wintry mix and we're going to see that on some of our hills mountains up above 3,000 feet so a lot of activity here with the possibility of in total getting about an inch of rain as we go through this forecast. A lot of showers for today, tomorrow, and then it tapers off early on Thursday morning. After that, sunshine and temperatures will quickly rebound into the mid to upper 60s as we go into the weekend as we spring forward. Yes, that's that reminder that we set our clocks forward this weekend. And San Francisco will see temperatures in the 50s for the next couple of days, but also feeling more like spring as we go into the weekend.